Broncos rookie wide receiver, Corlin Sutton, joining us tonight. How are you, man? I'm doing great. How you doing? I'm good, thank you. Well, I tell you what, you had a, a heck of a game down there in Arizona. Oh, yeah. It's part of the thank reason you. why we were off last week, because it was a Thursday night. I want to go back to the touchdown grab you had. What is it like when you are in the open field, you know you're wide open, you know the pass is coming from Emmanuel Sanders. <laughs> What's going through your mind at that moment? Don't drop this pass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Uh, it's uh, it's something about catching the ball with other people around you because you, like, you know where everybody is and everything. When you know you're the only person there, you know everybody's watching the ball come to you, and it's like a special play. You got a uh, wide receiver throwing to a wide receiver. you like, you got to make this play. And I, I look up and eat through it like as far as he possibly could, it seemed like. And I knew I had to make an adjustment. I was like, I got I to gotta catch it. I got to catch it. How good did that feel, not just for you, but to get the offense rolling? Because obviously that Arizona game ended up being uh, the, the butt kicking that Vaughn Miller had called for earlier in the week. How nice was that to have that type of play? And how many times did you guys practice that? <laughs> Uh, we, we practice, we'll have like a special play in, you know, we practice it every week uh, just in case, you know, you never know when you might want to use something like that. But it was funny, as soon as we got to a certain part of the field and I heard the personnel that came in, I was like, oh yeah, we're about to, <laughs> it's about to happen. Um, but to, you know, be able to, to go out there and perform the way we performed and, and to, to do the things we did and to back Vaughn up from the words that he put out that earlier that week, it was awesome to be able to go out there and perform to the level that we did and to, to show, you know, the rest of the NFL and the rest of the, the fans out there that, you know, we can we can play at a very high level when, we, when we're clicking. We just got to make sure we build that together and keep it together so that we can keep that going the rest of the season. Um, let's talk about Demarius Thomas and Emmanuel Sanders. When you first got here, we had an opportunity to talk about that. You said, hey, look, I'm really looking forward to learning from those guys, veterans who have been in this league for a long time. What have you taken away from them now that you've had some time to work with them? Uh, there's a lot of on the field things, but there's also a lot of off the field things um, about how, how to take care of your body, um, how to study. Uh, there's so many. There's, there's a lot of time, a, a lot more time throughout the day that we get than that we didn't get in college. Um, you know, in college you kind of forced to to go to study hall. You kind of forced. You have a lot of time that you that you're in classes. That you a lot of times you're in meetings. Um, but in NFL, we're done pretty much at like four o'clock. So you got four to whatever time you go to bed to get your extra studying in for the week so that you can be prepared for the upcoming game. Um, so I, getting to talk to them about, you know, what to study, how to study, the best ways to do those things, the best way to take care of my body, get them massages, get in the, the chiropractors, all those things. Um, and then on the field, just understanding how to play loose and, and understanding the, the ins and outs of, of the position that we play because those two have been playing the position at a high level for a very long time. So they got so much knowledge to share with myself and the rest of the, the young guys in the room. You guys are getting ready for game eight, which means you're basically halfway through your rookie season. Has life in the NFL been easy? easier or harder than what you anticipated? I would say it's 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 a mixture. Um, because like I said, there's there in college you had the mandatory this, man, everything was mandatory. Um, but here the, no no coach is gonna beg you to do the extra studying that you that you need to do to be able to get on the field. It's all up to you uh, about doing the extra study and make sure that your body's right so that you can go perform at a high level um, on the on the game uh, either Sunday, Monday, or Thursday. So uh, I would say that there's there's a mixture. Um, college had its, its thing, um, and NFL has this thing that, that kind of makes it both difficult. Um, but I embrace it. I, I enjoy the challenge. Um, I'm having a lot of fun with it. 